King! What's good, YouTube? King Blazer bring you guys another Xbox news video, and Microsoft has dropped the bomb on us. Hey, at least we know when the release date is. Again, if you guys enjoy these type of videos, make sure to go ahead and hit that subscribe to join the vibe. It really helps the channel if you guys hit that like button. Also, I'm always on Twitch, so if you guys want to go ahead and follow me over there, I'm always playing all these different type of games. It would be greatly appreciated. Also, I do got a Twitter set up so you guys can know exactly when I drop my new videos and when I go live on Twitch. Again, I appreciate each and everyone's support. Let's get right into it. So a few of us saw this coming. Some didn't want to believe it. But yes, it's true. Halo has been delayed till 2021. Now, this is a good thing for Halo, if you ask me. But this is the worst case scenario for the Xbox Series X. Now, again, let's get into exactly what 343 and Microsoft have to say about the delay. So according to 343 and over there at Xbox, today I want to share an important Halo development update with the community. We have made the difficult decision to shift our release date to 2021 to ensure the team has adequate time to deliver a Halo game experience that meets our vision. The decision to shift our release is the result of multiple factors that have contributed to development challenges, including the ongoing COVID related impacts affecting us all this year. I want to acknowledge the hard work from our team at 343 Industries who have remained committed to making a great game and finding solutions to development cha challenges. However, it is not sustainable for the well-being of our team, the overall success of the game to ship it this holiday. They go on and say, we know this will be disappointing to many of you and we will share the same sentiment. The passion and support this community has shown over the years has been incredible and inspiring. We wanted nothing more than to play our game with the community this holiday. The extra time will let us finish the critical work necessary to deliver the most ambitious Halo game ever at the quality we know our fans expect. Thank you for the support and understanding. Chris Lee, studio head over at Halo Infinite. Now, I know everyone's going to say that, hey, Xbox wasn't ready. This is why you shouldn't buy an Xbox. They can't even get their game out. Whatever it is that everyone wants to take shots at Xbox. And hey, I can't even disagree on that point. But I will say one thing. I'm happy to see it. And the reason I say that is because finally a company is willing to say, you know what? I'd rather take the loss and bite the bullet on whatever is going to happen to make sure that we bring out a game that's worthy for the for the money that we're asking for. I mean, the game that they were dropping, obviously, they knew wasn't going to be up to par. I mean, everyone says that was just an early build, blah, 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 blah. No, that was going to be the game that they were going to give us. And it wasn't a good game. Again, if you were just looking on just gameplay and probably how the mechanics work, it was Halo. So it would have worked. But if you were going off of this is going to be next gen, this is going to be the greatest looking game. This is the reason why you need an Xbox Series X. They were going to fall flat on their face and they knew that they needed to step it up. I'm glad that they were able to see it. They weren't, you know, too high on their horse to say, you know, it doesn't matter. We're going to get the money anyways. They know that they need Halo to succeed. If Halo fails, it's a wrap for Xbox. But Xbox fans, I got some good news for you. Better news, we have a release date. Xbox Series X will be dropping on November. And we know for a fact that there's an Xbox Series S too. So let me go ahead and give you a quick little insight on how I know Xbox Series X will be dropping on November. Now we know this information was dropped just to save face, but basically over at the Xbox Wire they say, there will be thousands of games to play spanning four generations when Xbox Series X launches on November. Also got over 100 tiles optimized for the Xbox Series S to take advantage of the Xbox Series X's power. Now I wonder why they would say that. Maybe because they don't have a great launch lineup. No reason really for anybody to buy an Xbox. Maybe. But we all know again they're going to be fans out there. We're going to buy an Xbox. I'm going to buy an Xbox. And again the price is right i'm sure there's going to be a few people that will buy xbox so i know they're going to do the right thing i'm sure they will especially after this bombshell that was dropped on their lap 
pricing is going to be a big reason on why xbox will still succeed when it comes into this next generation and why people will still buy it but i do want to get one fact out there before i get out of there this is for playstation fans out there playstation has the best exclusives downright fact no argument but if you are a console player that is buying a playstation and does not buy not one and I mean not one of those exclusives, you will do yourself a disservice if you decide to buy a PlayStation over an Xbox. Because this is fact. Any multi-console next-gen game will play better on the Xbox Series X. And if you're looking for your best experience and also something that might save you some money down the road, I encourage you to look into that Xbox a little bit more deeper again this is your boy i appreciate everyone coming through if again if you guys enjoy all these type of videos make sure to hit that like button it really helps the channel grow if you guys are new to the channel hit that subscribe to join the vibe i always let you guys know that i'm always on twitch so if you can go ahead and follow me over there i'm always playing different type of live games if you want to follow me on twitter so you can know exactly when i drop my videos and when i go live on twitch go ahead and follow me over there you can contact me there and tell me and talk to me anytime you guys like again i appreciate each and everyone's support y'all know how this thing goes it's the king hey